The answer is antimatter. It is by far the most expensive substance on Earth, costing $62.5 trillion per gram, or antigram I suppose. The reason for the extreme cost is the massive amounts of energy that the particle accelerators require. But antimatter is also found naturally, and is closer to you than you think. Small amounts of antimatter constantly rain down on the Earth in the form of cosmic rays, energetic particles from space. These antimatter particles reach your atmosphere at a rate ranging from less than 1 per square meter to more than 100 per square meter. Scientists have also seen evidence of antimatter production above thunderstorms. But other antimatter sources are even closer to home. For example, bananas produce antimatter, releasing one positron, the antimatter equivalent of an electron, about every 75 minutes. This occurs because bananas contain a small amount of potassium-40, a naturally occurring isotope of potassium. As potassium-40 decays, it occasionally spits out a positron in the process. Our bodies also contain potassium-40, which means positrons are being emitted from you, too. Antimatter annihilates immediately on contact with matter, so these antimatter particles are very short-lived. People are actually studying how to fuel spacecraft with antimatter. Just a handful of antimatter can produce a huge amount of power, making it a popular fuel for futuristic vehicles in science fiction. Antimatter rocket propulsion is hypothetically possible, the major limitation is gathering enough antimatter to make it happen.